And the Tesla chief executive, Elon Musk, is without doubt a pioneer in his field. Think about it. He brought us PayPal. He also has brought us the Tesla car and SpaceX. He's constantly pushing the frontiers. So it's not surprising, perhaps, that he loves to read about biographies. And in particular, in this weekend's Reading for Leading, he's telling us about the history of the aviator and the businessman Howard Hughes. I'll, t I'll tell you honestly the book, the book I'm reading, uh, which I was sort of thinking, should I say this or not? But um, it's a, it's a uh, book on Howard Hughes, um, <laughs> which, um, you know, uh, maybe a cautionary tale. I mean, he's sort of an interesting fellow. Um, def definitely want to make sure I don't uh, grow my fingernails too long and start peeing in jaws. But, but... <laughs> you beat me to the line. I was just about to right. say, why Howard Hughes? What is it about him that you found interesting? I, I've just been meaning to read a book about him for ages, and I, I haven't. And so I'm broadly aware of, of, of his sort of the things he's done. And um, I saw the movie The Aviator and, you know, and a few, a few other things. <laughs> I like biographies in general. Um, biographies, I think, are, are really, you know, really interesting read. Um, what do uh, you learn from them? Well, I think you learn a lot depending upon you know whose life you're reading about. Um, there, there are lots of lessons in there. I read Isaacson's biography of Jobs, which I thought was quite interesting, and I actually really liked um, his biography of Benjamin Franklin, uh, who, who I would say is certainly one of my heroes. He seemed like a really great guy. And you, you actually managed to incorporate any of this into your own strategy, your own way of doing business, your own ethos and philosophy? Well, I think in the case of Franklin, he did what needed to be done at the time it needed to be done. So, you know, he was in different fields and, and yeah. um, he sort of thought about, okay, what's the important thing that needs to be accomplished right now and then worked on that. Are you an online, on tablet, a Kindle or a crinkle of the paper? There is something romantic about traditional books, of course, um, but I find uh, since I'm traveling so much and, and um, uh, that, that, that I often find I'm reading the books on my iPhone, uh, which may sound like, wow, this is really tiny, but uh, pass, it's always pa with pass you. Pass me my iPhone. <laughs> pass me. I mean, two more You're not reading the Howard Hughes book on your iPhone. Yes, I am. Yeah. You're reading a Howard Hughes book on something the size of this? Yes. <laughs> it's, it's, it's small, but it uh, works. Bye.